Let's move on, shall we? Channel 4, uh, let's cut to the chase. Do you think it should be privatised or not? The Culture Secretary Nadine Doris has tweeted that the government ownership is holding Channel 4 back. She reckons that selling it to a private owner would give it the tools and freedom to flourish and thrive as a public service broadcaster. Hmm, what do we think to this? Daniel Moylan. Well, I think this is a tremendous practical political joke by the government because what it's done is it has fired up in fury all of the people who want to keep Channel 4 in state ownership. But the key thing about it is there are only about 2,000 of them in the whole country and most of them live in Islington. The vast majority of people in this country, if you stop them in the street, if you went to a pub, they wouldn't be able to tell you who owns Channel 4 today. If you ask them, do you watch it, they'd say no. Um, and nobody is actually interested in this. This is a fantastic non-story. But it'll keep all the lefty on steroids um, tweeting crazed things about fascism in our day um, for, for weeks and months. Um, it doesn't matter whether they privatise it or not. They've totally distracted the left and driven them off into a furious frenzy for weeks to come. And that's where they belong. That's where they belong. Keep them over there <laughs> arguing about something that simply does not matter to the vast majority of this pe the people in this country. Well, it matters to a few people. Let me just read out um, a couple of tweets from some pom prominent people, shall I? I think you're making my point for me. Um, well, yeah, because and I'm going to bring you in, Frank, on this, by the way, because I found this quite fascinating, the suggestion that some people are saying. So Kirsty Allsop, for example, um, TV presenter, she's saying this is a load of utter twaddle. No true Conservative would, se would sell Channel 4. Lady T, obviously, meaning Thatcher, would be spinning in her grave. It was set up to foster the British film and TV industry, and it has done that job admirably. Mm. Any Tory MP that votes for this is a traitor to their party and country, a bit extreme. Uh, Alistair Campbell is saying that this uh, Channel 4 move is right out of the Orban playbook and time to make it blatant. Part of the purpose is to wind up the Liberals. Is this out of the Orban playbook? Because for just a moment, sorry, yeah. Alistair Campbell, there, what Orban is accused of doing is nationalising private broadcasters and bringing them under government control. This is the absolute reverse. How can, Alistair, how can this nutcase actually say things like that? <laughs>